Hey everyone, just another quick video from Mueller Energy. Um, some of you that have ordered this battery may have noticed that we've gone from M8 to M10 ter terminals on these. And we've had a couple of customers say that they would have preferred M8 terminals because they are more common. Oops, that was loud. Um, and, and that's correct. Like the reason we went to M10 is that you have a lower uh, resistance in these, uh, that they're, they're chunkier connectors, internal and external. Um, but yeah, it, it's true that a lot of, of Victron gear, for example, uses M8 ring terminals. Uh, so because of that, we've gotten in some M10 to M8 adapters. Uh, I know they look like they might be stainless steel. They're nickel coated brass. Um, which I know has a, a somewhat higher resistance than copper, but given that it's it's much harder than copper, it's much easier to machine. Um, I, and I'll, I'll just show you the, the difference now. Uh, so obviously you can just screw these in here. The bolt, by the way, the washer and the split washer are all um, stainless steel. Um, so I screw these in here. And you can see it still goes on and there's still plenty of room in there for your ring terminals. So three ring terminals or so, no problem at all. Um, now I'll just do a very quick test on how it changes the internal resistance of the battery. So I've got my trusty meter here. I hope you can see that in the video. Um, and let's do it without first and it comes up as my hand might be in the way 3.17 milliohms um, now if we go including the adapters it goes to 3.2 3.21 uh, milliohms so you can see this virtually no difference there and obviously it's not going to be a problem so if you would like uh, some adapters and it will make your life a little bit easier um we'll we'll sell them at a cheap price of 15 bucks for two posted uh, so please let me know thank you bye